Welcome back to the Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. As I said, I'm going to reload before the final battle and continue playing the game. Would you like to buy something from my stash? Let's play cards. Gwent wouldn't be bad. This entire video will be about me trying to find Gwent merchants. I could play with Skoetel, but I could also try my luck with the monsters. So good luck with that one, I guess, on my part. I do have the Drog. I do have Triss, I do have Mysterious Elf. That does put me in a good enough position where I can actually use this particular deck to actually play. I'm gonna remove that one Necker from my deck and add the Vampire. Also the Artillery, actually. Uh, yeah, this deck is kind of terrible, isn't it? Oh, really fucking terrible, right? Eh, I'll deal with it. Alright, that was quite oh. easy, but and I also got the Brewus card. Now I'm gonna go here. There's a small Oh actually no, it's it's random? What? Are you fucking bullshitting me? It's random. On top of all that crap, it's oh. random where you get the cards. Great. Like earlier I had played them with the Scoyatel deck and he had given me the Chrome Brewus. Actually, I had played them several yes, times with the Square Tell Deck and he had given me the Chrome Brewus. Most humbly beg your pardon, but I'm in quite a predicament, see? I'm, I'm a wandering juggler from occupied Temeria and... Temeria? You sure? Not Novigrad? What? Why Novigrad? No, no, I come from Malibor and... Uh, you're not cut out for this line of work. Memory's too short. See, we've met. But you were a respected Novigrad merchant who wanted desperately to get home. Oh, but, but I assure you, I... All right, all, all right, you got me. I, I know this all looks bad, but I, I swear I, I'll pay you back, mate. All of it, with, with interest. Just please, don't, don't take me to the yard. Think you could fool me a second time? I'm gonna let the Jarl decide what to do with you. Force me to come with you? Go ahead, try. Out of a jam, don't you? No, that's a decoration. Where'd 
Where are you going? Lying scumbag got what he deserved. I wonder what happens if you let them go. Do you think I'm so stupid as to let them go? That's just uh, the epitome of stupidity. I helped him once because I didn't need the coin. Now oh, I got the coin back. I wonder if he would actually pay you with interest. A beautiful skeleton. Greetings. Greetings. Mind if I... See ya. Fare thee well. I kinda wish there was an option to exit the dialogue from just the merchant screen instead of having to press an extra, extra button. I mean, it makes sense that it takes you back to them screen when you've got NPCs that might have more to say than that. But she doesn't, for instance. Uh, I actually don't think there's anything on Art Skellige, at least in terms of merchants. There might be more in... I don't think in Larvik, but... Well, maybe here. Let's see. Let's go! Faster. And got fuck all in return. Ah, uh, well, there's an alchemy supply merchant there, but I doubt I can get cards. There's gotta be. Undvik does have nothing. There's an island there. Hmm. Let's try that one. Maybe there's a merchant there. If not, Oriala, maybe? I don't know. Maybe. Trying to see. You ain't from Northgard, are you? See? Watch it. Seen the white whale. I did. Wasn't that glorious? It seems this place is the only location where 
uh, getting to a certain story point has any consequences on the world because people are talking about stuff that's happening at about this point, like the White Whale, Nilfgaard, uh, being at the gates, all that kind of stuff. It's mentioned here. Oh, greatens, greatens. <laughs> what brings it to me? Wouldn't mind a look at your wares. In the mood for some diversion. What brings it to me? In the mood. Zero special cards, are you kidding me? Anyway, let's get some decoys then. Fighting frost, scorches, and that kind of stuff. Okay, that should do just fine. I'll get rid of the fucking, uh... Cockatrice. Who gives a shit about that piece of crap? Okay.
What the hell did I just gain there as a card? Such a bloody name. Though before I go, there is a merchant I may want to... Oh, and actually an innkeep. Let's check that innkeep first. For the Vagabond! What you get? Hey, stranger. Looking for some entertainment? Want a drink? What kind of entertainment you got in mind? What? Why beer, mead, and strong spirits? What do you expect in a tavern? Jump poop. I don't know where you're from. But I can see it's far off. Show me what you have in stock. The Brockvar clan. Can you tell me about it? We from the Brockvar clan are masters of the sea. Bred and born to the water. Thought everyone in Skellige spent a lot of time in the water. <laughs> They think so too, but all they do is skim the top of it in their long ships, all wrapped up in heavy furs. From time to time, the wind blows a bit of spray from the oars in their faces. That's their only contact with water. Whereas our boys, as soon as they can walk, dive off cliffs into the very depths of the sea. What would you say to a little game of Gwent? Ah, fuck. Hey, choose your poison. What would you say to a little game? I'd say it's time for an elf card to teach you some bloody manners. 
That's just my opinion. That card, that monster right there is very goddamn powerful. I'll remove this. Or actually, you know what, I'll stick with the young emissary. Though I could use more of him. If I'm to die today, I wish to look smashing for the occasion. Ah, Kira. Well, fuck. Well, I'll just get taller then. Then I'd say it's time to play as the Northern Realms, dispense with all the pleasantries. Right, right. I'd get rid of the siege expert and go.
Do I risk it? Fuck it, I'll go for it. Hey, choose your point. What would you say to a... I came so close and yet I failed. Ah, step aside. What can I do for you, traveler? Can you trim my hair? Way it is now, it gets in my eyes. So long. I think I've got it. Looks like rain. Thanks for stating the obvious, Geralt, after it started, I might add. What? Damn the dogs, you don't look like one to haggle. Show me what you got and we'll see. So long. Geralt is right, the way his hair w is right now, it would get in his eyes. But I hate every single hairstyle that the game offers. I would be willing to go for bald Geralt, however. But isn't that an atrocity against humanity? <laughs> right? Bald Geralt cannot be allowed to exist. Alright, I think that maybe Merchant and Larvik. Maybe. I doubt it, however. But I think that's the only situation where I'd... Only place where I'd find a uh, merchant. Well, maybe here as well, but... Hear that noise? That's Freya, grinding her teeth. <laughs> Means wars are brewing. Time to sharpen our swords. With Brand dead, who will lead you? Don't need a king to stick it to the black ones. No reason to wait. 
Show me what you have in stock. Smithing. Pretty tiring job. Need a break, maybe? Relax a bit? Play a game or two of Gwent? Well, well. I kind of feel sorry for Doug Cuckle and all the voice work he probably did for stuff like this. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, place that as well. No way he's gonna pull out of this one intact, unless he has all the crones. And then this happens, of course it does. Right, well, let's hope. a useless pile of crap of a cart. Oh, there is the innkeep. Hey, I love the rain. Another one struck and come to see the druids. <laughs> <laughs> Greetings, stranger. Have a drink with us. What are you offering? for a few rounds of Gwent.
Okay, I think I have one. If he uses anything that's really powerful. Well, he did use that ballista and that ballista has a lot of points, so I'll just scorch the fuck out of that thing. Hmm. Ain't that lovely, Emlareth? My monster uh, collection gets more and more powerful with each and every victory. be your lucky day. Spending hard-earned coin, that's an art in itself. Let me have a look. Hard to argue with that. Want a bit more to spend, though. So how about a game of Gwent? I will crush him under the heels of my Arrakis's. Wait, what? Okay. Ah, it's monsters that you have in... Or actually, wait, I have two of the same kind, so that's why. It's different. I'm gonna go all in then. I'll use the monster card last. Well, isn't he a bitch with a very strong siege? Thank you. 
Where to next? Well, Fairland I would go, but I know there's no one there that sells useful cards. Let me check this place though, the outskirts of this village. Kill the cows. I dare not reload. <laughs> See, even reload there because I think I know what would happen then. <laughs> See, or maybe that only applies to white orchards. Who knows? Sure. Hey, you! What clan are you from? No clan. I'm from the continent. Skelliga warriors alone drink in this tavern. <laughs> Why are you here then? Don't look like warriors to me. More like shepherds. Every Skelliger's a warrior. Even him born in a sheep shack. But we don't expect you to understand. Every man's a thrall on the continent. Cringing afore his master like a mongrel whining for scraps neath the table. Whosoever denies shelter to a traveler disgraces himself and brings shame on his clan. Your dad's teaching nothing. Don't you talk to me about me da, Yorant, or I'll tuck you in neath the barrow. And you remember this, stranger. This here's not care trolda. And we's not on crate. Guests are not welcome. You don't mind the occasional traveler? I mind fools, no matter where they're from. Geralt of Rivia, Witcher. Jorant, son of Sigvald. If you've no one to drink with, sit down with me. Share some mead and a teal. If you're looking for a drinking companion, you've chosen well. If it's work you want, likewise, there's a monster needs slaying. I don't often raise such a hubbub. You must rarely get guests from the continent. Aye, true. When a Redanian or Tamarian grows the stones to come to Skellige, they usually go ashore at Kertrolda. Port's good there. Merchants are plenty. And the Jarl's right merciful to Continentals. Those two boys, the pesky ones, who were they? Cory and Cracky. Only ever troublesome, as is their father, Leith. He interesting in some way? Depends. If it's liars and cards that interest you, then very much so. So long. Must be the one who got us completely mad. He's raised Dunar's villages. Halt. Well, what? A game of Gwent. How about it?
Clever bitch. Show me what you've got. Specialty goods alone. But I don't expect a tramp from the continent to know him from tripe. See? Well, got the taller card. Well, what is it? I knew if he fell. To the hair with Hitch, he'd never make his long chips. Swords on his back. What'll I think of next? Well, my dad's off fighting the black ones. Jeepers. If me eyes don't deceive me, you're the white wolf, warrior, lover, philosopher extraordinaire. Someone's fed you a load of... And a friend of the great master Dandelion himself? The great master Dandelion. Hey, who built you a monument more lasting than any of bronze. When next you see him, white wolf, please convey the great esteem in which I, Sigurd, hold his many achievements. Oh, I'll be sure to tell him exactly what I think of his... tales. It would be a disgrace to censor such an artist. Though a smith by trade, I too do my best work in words. Let's play cards. Gwent wouldn't be bad. Rotten Mangonel. Who has that actually? Elfgard? Okay. For all that's worth. Anyway.
Can say that didn't hurt a lot. White Wolf? Wouldn't mind a look at your wares. See ya. Hey now! Okay, so... Did that... What next? There is a lighthouse there. There's also Sir... Sir... Whatever. Village here. Village there. Well, yeah, a lot of villages. I thought Skellige would be easy. <laughs> Apparently, I was wrong. Said sword is very goddamn expensive, kid. So no, thank you. Sund. I was pronouncing it wrong. Anyway, that's where I'm going. Fuck the bandit camp. Come on, Roach. Let me guess, empty. What happened here? Why is this place abandoned yet? Yeah, there's probably a monster contract here, I bet.
But generally when that happens, you can probably find and slay the monster before picking up the contract. Here it's not the case. Well, I've been to all the settlements. Costine here, signing out.